everyone, welcome back to another Mabel's Mystery Mayhem episode where I'm going to be opening up some more blind boxes that you guys have requested. So I asked you guys in my previous video and also on my Instagram which items you wanted to see and I got a few requests for some more mini brands so I have this series 2 wall here. I also got some requests for some of the most recent blind boxes that I've bought and I also got a request for some Disney items and I recently got this Disney Dora rules from series 8 so this one fits that request. I also got some more requests for Toki Doki, so I have this Mama Corno Series 2 blind box. I got a lot of requests for Pop Mart, and in particular the 100% Space Molly series. And then I also got a lot of requests for Pucky, so I picked out this Pucky Space Babies. I got a request for some spooky themed blind boxes, as Halloween is coming up. So I thought the Space Babies fits this theme, and also this Walking Dead vinyl figure. And then the last item that I picked out is this Splatoon minifigure series. I love collecting these little minifigures and I recently made some videos on my TikTok and you guys love seeing them. So I thought I would open up another one of those blind boxes. So make sure to watch to the end of the video to see all the blind boxes that are available for the upcoming episodes and let me know which one you want to see open next. I'll also leave a link to my playlist in the description box if you guys want to check out some more Mavis Mystery Mayhem episodes. So let's open up the first item. Let's open up this Dorables blind box first. So these ones are mini Disney figures and this one's from series 8. And inside there's either two or three figures and there's 58 to collect and they also have a special scented one. Let's open up this box. We have like a plastic bit on the top here. And a blind bag inside and then we also have a checklist. Let's have a look at this. So we have common, rare, ultra rare, special edition and limited edition. And we have the fairies, we have Alice in Wonderland, Monsters Inc, Hercules. And on this side we have these scented ones. We have Turning Red, Wreck-It Ralph, Young Princesses, Big Hero 6 and Lady and the Tramp. So from this one I'd love to get one of the ones from Turning Red or maybe one of the scented ones here. And then I also like the Monsters Inc designs. So we have two blind bags. Let's open up this first one. And let's see who it is. And oh, we got one from Turning Red. This is so cute. Let's have a look at the checklist. This is Abby. I love her little heart earrings. Let's put her there. And then we have this second blind bag. So who this one is. And oh, we got a Monsters Inc one. Yay, I got two from the series that I wanted. So we have Sully here, and he's actually like painted in kind of like a pearl paint, which looks really cool. So those are the two figures from the Dorables blind box. Let's open up the next one. Next up we have this Walking Dead vinyl figure, and this is the In Memoriam series. So we have quite a few different characters, and they have different rarities as well. Let me know if you guys are still watching The Walking Dead. I haven't caught up on the latest seasons, but I think I'll have to watch it at some point as I really did like the show in the earlier seasons. So let's open this one up. And we have a blind bag here. Uh, let me grab my scissors. Open this one. And let's see if it is. Ready, one, two, three. Ooh, is this Shane? Actually, I'm not sure which character this is. It's a 1 in 36, so I will have to look this one up afterwards. I don't think it's Shane, as I think that might be Shane there. But this is actually a really detailed little minifigure. It has like all the details for the jacket and the shirt, and even the shoes and the pants. And it's nicely painted as well. Let's grab the next item. Let's open up the Puffy Space Baby series next. So in this series there are 12 designs and a hidden edition. So we have the Pyramid Alien, UFO Baby, Pockel Alien, Robo Alien, Furry Alien, Love Ranger, Piranha Alien, Astronaut Baby, Moon Baby, Star Baby, Octopus Alien, a hidden edition, and then the Reptilian Baby on the front here. So from this one I'd like to get the Star Baby. I think the hidden edition would look really cool as well as it looks like it's in a spaceship. And then I also like the UFO baby and the fairy alien. Open up this box. Let's cut this bag. And let's see what it is. Ready, one, two, three. 
Oh, we got the fairy one. Oh my gosh, I love the colors for this one. The purple is super pretty. And we have some different like polka dots here. It has a blue neck and then like pearl arms. And it even has little nails that are painted in blue. And on the bottom here, it has the Pop Mart and Pucky logos. That is so cute. I'm really happy with this one. Let's grab the card for this. So there's a picture of the furry alien there. And there's the back. Next up, we have the Mini Brand Series 2. And in this series, we have Ultra Rare Frozen Moment Minis. I haven't opened any of Series 2 yet, so I'm excited to see what the designs look like. Let's open this tear tab. And let's take this part off here. And we can separate all the pieces. So let's open this one first. And oh, we got the one with the checklist, which was lucky. So let's have a quick look at this checklist. So there are some frozen moments. We have gold ones, glow in the dark, metallic, and then common items. I'm not sure if we have all of these items here in Australia, so it's going to be interesting to see. So we have some money and some like accessories. Let's see what's in this one. Oh, it looks like we got some like money. So we have these little $5 bills and oh my gosh, they're actually so detailed. And then we got this little packet and this is a Swizzles Chew Crew. I don't think I've ever seen these before. We will look at all the numbers of these afterwards, but let's grab the next one. And oh, what's this song? These are Swizzles Drumsticks. Looks like it's the same um, company, but I haven't heard of these either. But they look like they're some sort of candy. Let's put that one there open this one and oh it looks like we have a shopping cart that will actually be really useful to store all the items Let's take all these pieces out comes with some little stickers as well so i will put that one together in a moment let's grab this one next and it looks like this is a container and this is a packet of rice noodles and then the last one here let's open it and let's see this one is a Revlon product. It says Ultra HD Snap. That is such a cute little bottle. So let's put all of these together. So there is the shopping cart all put together. We also have these little mini brand stickers, which I might stick on the outside of the box there. And then here are all the items. So we can put them into the shopping cart, which is such a cool display. We can put some of them down the bottom here as well. And put them in like that and let's have a look at the checklist so from this one i got number 72 i also got some of the money which is the five dollar bills which are number 102 i also got the shopping cart which is 111 and then we have some of the candy and i'm not sure if that one the ramen one is not metallic so it's not that one there i also got the chew crew bag which is number 32 and the drumsticks, which are number 34. And then I also got number 51, which are the noodles. Onto the next blind box, we have this Mermaclono from series two. And on the side here, we have the designs. So we have Coraline, Layla, Lilypad, Perlina, Aquaria, Sharkbite, Cerulean, and Phantasma. And the chaser from this series is Sharkbite. I think I already have Perlina from this series. So I'd also like to get either Coraline or Lilypad. Let's open up this box. We have some sticky tape on the outside. And here's the blind bag. And we also have another little checklist. Let's grab the blind bag. And let's open this one up. And let's see who it is. Ready, one, two, three. And oh, who is this one? It's the one at the bottom. This one is Phantasma. And I actually really like this. It actually fits like a Halloween theme quite well as it kind of looks like a skeleton. I love the contrast of the bright paint here and then the black paint here. This one has a little Toki Doki logo here. We have a little fish skeleton up the top here as well. And it also has some metallic paint details on the horn, on the Toki Doki logo, and then the feet. So I'll have to put this one out as a Halloween decoration as I think it will look really cool. So let's open up the next blind box. Let's open up the Splatoon blind box next. So in this series there are eight designs, 
So from this one, I'd like to get the ink brush there. I also like the slosher and the Splattershot Junior. Let's open this. And let's see which design it is. Ready, one, two, three. And oh, we got the slosher, yay. Let's take this one out of the packaging. So here is the slosher. These miniatures are really well made and the painting on them is really nice as well. And then it also comes with a stand. So have the base of the stand there. And then we have these extra pieces here, which we can put together. So here is the stand put together and then I think it just sits on the stand like that. Let's open up the last blind box. So the last blind box we have is this Space Mully 100% series and this is from series 1. So these ones are made by Popmart and they usually make these Space Mollies as the larger figures but this is the first time they've made like a blind box series. So I was really excited when these got released. So in this series we have Watermelon, Jelly, Christmas, Toffee, Candy, Spongebob. Little Painter, Keith Haring, and Instinct Toy. From this one, I'd like to get the Instinct Toy design. I also like the candy one, the watermelon, and the jelly. Let's open this one. It is the blind bag. Let's see what design it is. Ready, one, two, three. Oh, we got the watermelon one. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. I love the red and green colors. So here's the little accessory. It even has Molly written on the side there. And then I think this one will fit in her hand. Let's also have a look at the figure. It has some plastic around the sides here. Let's take that off. And then we can take the other side off as well. And then I think these figures are slightly poseable. So you can move her arm up and down, and then this one can move as well. There's also some different paint to use. So we have this matte paint on the suit here, and then this like pearl kind of paint on the arms, and also used on the gas tanks here. Then we have some like semi-transparent plastic used here, which looks really cool. And then on the bottom of her shoes, we have the Pop Mart and Kenny's Work logos. So there is the Molly figure. I think this one is so cool. So let's grab the card for this one. So it says Mega Collection 100% Space Molly, and this is the watermelon one. And there's the back. So that was everything for today's Mavis Mystery Mayhem episode. It's really hard to choose a favourite from today, as I got a few of my favourite designs. But I'm really happy to finally have a Space Molly figure, and it was super lucky to get one of my favourite designs. Let me know in the comments which item was your favourite, and also let me know which blind boxes or gacha capsules you'd like to see opened in the next episode. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!